Hi, this is James Wilson with MTV Strength Training Systems, and I'm here today with one of my star clients, Colleen Craig, who's going to do a uh, guest demo for us on this uh, combination drill. But I'm going to go over what the exercises are um, for the combo demo this month and then explain why they're important. We're going to do a suitcase deadlift. We're going to do a full clean. That's basically a clean into a full squat. We're going to do a side press. And then uh, we're going to finish off with a windmill. We're going to do five reps of each. And so uh, the, the suitcase deadlift is basically where you've got your uh, dumbbell or your kettlebell, whatever you're using, you're standing uh, next to it, coming down into your deadlift position, hips back, letting your shoulders come down over your toes. You're going to drive through the heels, squeeze your glutes, get tall at the top, come back down, keep that arm back so that your kettlebell is landing by the heels. Again, drive through the heels, squeeze, get tall. Deadlift is just our base position on our bike. You've got to feel just very comfortable with coming down into this position and then driving through the hips to come out of it. So once you've done five reps of that, you get set, spread your feet apart, get it in the middle, you're going to do a full clean, hips back, snap the hips, pull it up, time it so that you catch it. So down into a clean, timing that catch. Down into a clean, timing that catch. So I'll show you from the side real quick. You want to make sure you're pushing the hips back, snapping the hips to create that uh, um, the hip drive that we're looking for. So using the kettlebell here, if you're using the dumbbell, same thing, between the hips up, time that catch. So five reps of that, then we go into a side press, pushing up, pushing those hips out to the side, and then back to center. So as I push up, hips are driving out to the side, back to center. So we're going to do five reps of that, and then on our fifth rep, we're going to stay overhead, you're going to come down into a windmill, and then back up. Make sure you got those abs braced nice and tight for this one, you can definitely kind of tweak the lower back. So I'll show you from the side here, basically you're coming down, you're wanting to touch the floor on the inside of your foot, and then drive yourself back up and lock it out. So that's basically that. So again. We got our uh, suitcase deadlift, just working on that base position on our bike, the leg drive. We've got the full clean, so we're working on that hip snap that we need to pick the front end of the bike up, bunny hop, jump, all those power movements on the bike. We're timing that full clean, so we're working on, on timing and using the legs to help control our, uh, our momentum down, which is extremely important on our bike, so we're not just pounding into the ground all the time. And we've got our side press, working on some shoulder strength, and then we've got our windmill, which is working on some hip mobility, which is extremely important for cornering, so you're able to get those mm -hmm. hips out to the side to help counterbalance you when you're leaning your bike. So we're incorporating a lot of different exercises that uh, encompass a lot of different skills that you need on your bike. So we're gonna do five reps to each of those, and then uh, rest for a bit, and then uh, we're gonna do five reps on the other side. And on the, on the blog post that I got at bikejames.com, I'll go over some, some different uh, schemes that you can use with this as far as like rounds and time and stuff like that that you can use. So anyway, so that's this month's combo demo of the month. Now we're going to watch Colleen. All right, so Colleen's a local, uh, local ripper. And despite all my best efforts, I haven't turned you into a downhiller yet, have I? No. No, all right. So <laughs> still trail rider to the core. So, but uh, anyway, so she's going to demonstrate our combo demo this month. So. All right, five suitcase deadlifts. Good up, nice. Driving through those heels, squeeze, get tall, good. Brace those abs, up, squeeze, get tall, good. Two more, squeeze, get tall, good. Drive through the heels, squeeze, glutes, get tall, good. Set up for the swing, good, full swing. Or clean, I mean, good, full clean, nice. See, she's listening, or not listening to me. Nice. Right into the next one. Good timing. Good. Snapping the hips. Good. Nice. Excellent. Now we're going into our side press. Driving those hips over. Back to center. Good. Driving those hips over. Back to center. Yeah, you guys will watch. She's not bending over. She's driving those hips and then bringing them back to center. She's really working that lateral hip movement on this. You're not just bending over. Yep, so drive it up one more time. Now you're going into your windmill. Good. Nice. 
And again, watching those hips. She's driving those hips over. You see how much those hips are moving. Pushing over to the side. Back to center. Good. Two more. Down. Touching the floor. Back to center. Nice. Back to center. Excellent. And then down to the floor. Right on. So, right on. Well, that's it. Thank you very much, Colleen.